Good luck. Merhaba arkadaşlar. Hepiniz AFP Talks webinarlarına hoş geldiniz. Bugün University of Communities and Economics in Los'ta ekonomik ve kaliteli eğitimi Casper'dan dinliyor olacak. Lütfen sorularınızı questions kısmından sormayı unutmayın. Yes Casper, the stage is yours now. Thank you. Hello there, my name is Casper. I am I am working at the University of Humanities and Economics in Łódź in Poland. I am the head of the international office here, which is uh, which cares for the international students and programs uh, conducted in English language, but also in uh, for the students who are uh, learning in Polish, but they are international students. Now I will uh, present you our university. First of all, we are located in Poland. Poland is a country with over 38 uh, million inhabitants located in the central part of Europe. Poland is a beautiful combination of wonderful landscapes, charming villages and large dynamically developing cities. This location, rich culture and great beautiful long history make it an ideal place to start your studies and professional career. A few facts uh, about uh, Poland and Turkey and also about the about uh, Azerbaijan because we are working uh, with Azerbaijani agents and Azerbaijani students. Turkey has never recognized the partition of Poland in the, night, in the, uh, in the end of the uh, 18th century. Uh, the strong relationship uh, between Poland and, and Turkey lasts, um, lasts um, more than 600 years. Both Turkey and Azerbaijan, there, there were large Polish communities that run many organizations. Uh, we can proudly say that Poles have made good achievements in the history of both countries. Uh, let us mention at least two of them, like uh, General Józef Bem in Turkey and Engineer Witold Zglenicki in Azerbaijan. The city of Łódź, city of four cultures, uh, it's quite a young city because it was established uh, in the 19th century. Uh, it's, it is called of the city of uh, four cultures because uh, in the, the foundation of this, of this city were uh, given by the Polish citizens, uh, German citizens, uh, Russian citizens and uh, Jewish. Which is not an only attractive place to study, but also guarantees a job for professionals in many fields, like IT, IT sector, BPO services, startups, and many more, especially in the creative uh, industry. Currently, which is the fastest growing city in Poland. Moreover, it is positioned in the rankings as one of the most interesting tourist destinations in the world. Uh, which is the third largest city in Poland, located in the central part of Poland, has been an industrial center of textiles in 19th century because of its history of love, tolerance and acceptance and thanks to the to its charm and beauty, which is a home of hundreds of students from different countries and cultures. Here at our university, we have students from uh, 46 countries from all over the world. Here at these uh, photographies, you can see the city center and uh, our students. Um, here is Aigul from Uzbekistan and, uh, and uh, students from Azerbaijan, they are studying graphics. 
uh, and the other students at uh, management faculty. University of Humanities and Economics in Łódź, uh, as I thought before, is one of the oldest uh, private universities in, in Poland. We were established in 1993 and since then we are still developing, especially in, in the international uh, field. Um, why the students should choose AAG? Because they can uh, study in the center of Europe and travel throughout the Schengen area without restrictions. They can get European diploma. Uh, we are uh, one of the largest private universities and we have been entrusted with all, over eight, 85,000 uh, students from all over Europe and not only Europe because from the other countries too. Uh, we have been teaching for 28 years and we know how to prepare students for their success in European and other labor, labor markets. Why also you should choose AAG? Because we have flexible curricula tailored to the needs of our students. And the students can combine stud their studies and work to gain important experience on the labor market. Uh, we are teaching creativity and openness. Our university supports and develops creativity, so needed in many career paths. About this creativity, I will tell you a little bit uh, later. Um, each student who are uh, who are start during the studies can participate in internship programs, both in Poland and in and in abroad. Uh, students during their, their studies can use modern project methods, practice and training, like coaching methods. Uh, they can participate in Erasmus Plus program and get experience in European companies, universities and institutions. Mm, to maintain a high level of education, AAG provides modern and convenient infrastructure. The student hostel, uh, our Renoma health clinic, clinic, the sports center, radio TV training studio, computer rooms and large library. And finally, a couple of art galleries. The potential of our university. 28 years of experience. 85,000 graduates, six departments uh, in Łódź and six branch didactic centers uh, in other cities in Poland, the largest distance learning center in Central Europe, um, over 100 postgraduate uh, studies, huge and modernly equipped spaces in 19th century post in post-industrial buildings, uh, the students can study in English language. We have programs in Russian language and, of course, in Polish language. We have excellent, experienced and friendly academic staff. Programs which we have in English language. In bachelor degree, this is uh, political science, management, graphics, uh, and tourism and recreation. Those are the uh, studies in English language. In master's degree, we can offer you political science studies and management studies. We have also computer science in engineer de degree. Uh, this, those studies are specifically uh, technical studies and lasts a little bit more than a uh, bachelor degree because they are last seven semesters. We have there two specializations like programming technologies and ICT networks. 
start your education with us and get a perspective profession. When you will finish your studies and AAG, you get a diploma that confirms your academic degree. This is diploma, uh, not only a proof of education and academic degree received, but it is also recognized and accepted all over the world. Uh, we are going to make a um, dual degree programs with the universities uh, in United States and other countries, maybe in Turkey also, but about those uh, projects you can find out more soon on our website. Our students, you can, uh, you could see some of our students before on the uh, earlier slide. Here you can see Thomas who was, uh, who was uh, studying computer science, Anastasia from dance major, because we have also dance studies, we are, which are teach in Polish language, but we have a lot of international students in this dance uh, department, because dance, like the, like the other arts, uh, the language of of, of this art is quite international. Uh, Amanda from management and Christina from graphics. Uh, graphics studies are very popular in our university because we have um, spe two specialties. One which prepares uh, for the uh, work in multimedia, uh, multimedia systems and uh, and the other with 3D, uh, 3D design and game art. Mm, we have also Polish Virtual University, which is a unique solution in times of a worldwide pandemic. Um, Polish Virtual University uh, is engaged in, engaged in dissemination of modern teaching methods for more than a decade. It is the oldest and largest distance learning university in Central and Eastern Europe. Uh, we have the more than 20,000 graduates. Um, how does it look, this university? Uh, this is the online platform uh, where the students have an access and there, uh, using this platform, they can, uh, they can study. Uh, they can keep contact with the classmates and with the lecturers. Each student will have gaining access to this learning platform. The platform contains trainings, training materials, tasks, tests, quizzes, topics for discussion at the forum, along with the training requirements for each course. Uh, students work in group led by outstanding and experienced professors who provide answers to, to the questions, moderate discussions and define tasks and evaluate the implementations. Uh, the students com can communicate with the teachers and classmates through a discussion forum, chats and emails. What students gain uh, by this uh, online platform, uh, they have an they can have an ability to learn from anywhere at and any time. Uh, now, when the uh, pandemics pandemics restrictions has been provided in our country, uh, mo many students uh, decided to uh, go back to their home countries and because and thanks to this Polish virtual university, our platform, they can actually um, make the, their studies uh, by uh, online, by uh, remotely. Um, also studying uh, online, the, you, can, you can start, you can combine the work and family life uh, and you can save money and time. We have this unique educational idea which we are calling uh, 
technology of creativity. At the university, we follow one principle, de uh, develop your creativity. We try to focus on each student separately. We help them to de develop their passions and interests, but most, most of all, we support a creative approach to problem solving. Uh, we are trying to discover the hidden abilities and possibilities of each student because we are believing that everyone can be creative. To dispose of our students and the teachers, we have Arterion Studio, which is a cinema and television studio. This place makes it possible to connect communication technology and several other forms of information transfer, for example, text, sound, graphics, animation and video. Uh, this TV studio is fully equipped, enabling the creation of television programs, promotional and educational films, music videos, and video products for the internet. Uh, in those months, we are now in this uh, television studio, we are uh, launching our uh, internal university television uh, by internet. Uh, this studio is also the space with a full technical base where the students of our university practice their skills and show how they are connected with both steady measure and individual interests. We have also a couple of art galleries, um, exactly four art galleries. Uh, one we have opened uh, two weeks ago, and this is a gallery, art gallery, especially uh, for the works and exhibitions of our students. This, those are the spaces for creative, educational, animated events realized in the field of art on the basis of academic didactics. The main goal of, and mission of the gallery is to support scientific development of the Department of Arts, as well as support the artistic activity of students from all majors. The activities that take place here are the representation of the, um, of the students, teachers and invited artists' achievements. The mission of the gallery is cooperation with artists, students, cultural centers and institutions, as well as the organization of exhibition and seminars. Each student of the university uh, can take part in the Erasmus Plus exchange program. Erasmus is a program for universities, students and professors. The program supports international cooperation of universities, provides the opportunity for students to travel abroad for studying or internship, promotes mobility of university staff, creates opportunities for universities to participate in projects with foreign partners. Um, the University of Humanities and Economics in Łódź has been actively participating in the Erasmus program for many years, which enables students for, of bachelor and master degree of full-time and part-time stu studies to study and practice abroad. Studies can last one semester or one academic year. Internship lasts at, uh, at least three months. If you become our student, you will have a chance to go to one of, the, of several dozens of prestigious universities all over the Europe. Thanks to the funds from the European Union, uh, the students receive a high, high scholarship every month during the stay abroad. Um, we, are, we are collaborating also with one of the uh, agencies in Turkey. This is Paul Edu agency. You can find here the uh, contact information for this agency, which uh, which uh, provide the students to our university, especially for the 
um, course of English language. Uh, we have a program uh, for students uh, of, um, of course of English, which prepares the students to undertake their further studies. Uh, you can learn the, the, learn, uh, the English language um, almost from the basics uh, by one semester or one year and later uh, you can study in English or you can at our university or you can get the certificate and uh, find uh, your, uh, your work or the further studies at other institutions. Here you can find the contact information to our university and our uh, center of the international studies. Uh, if you wrote, wrote uh, to us at our general email study at aag.lodz.pl, you can uh, ask for more information uh, and, and find, uh, find there the um, uh, find there the inform uh, through this email you can find the information about our programs, the admission process, the fees, and uh, and anything what would you like to know. Um, thank you for watching this presentation. Now I will show you a short uh, movie about our students. You can find those movies on our uh, on our channel at YouTube. If you come, yes, you can do anything. I'm studying management. I'm studying game art and 3D graphics. Project management, 3D art. I study computer science in AG. University of Humanities and Economics in the city Wuch. Wuch is so cozy. Wuch is in the heart of the pocket. So it's very close to different cities, accessible to different countries. My name is Gilshan Olujova. I'm a student of University of Humanities and Economics in Boj. I'm from Azerbaijan. My name is Arlan. I'm from Turkey, Istanbul. My name is Alex Abid and I'm from Bangladesh. My name is Evelyn. I'm from Turkey. My name is Chi Amaka Anyamu from Nigeria. <laughs> Meeting with my friends and hanging out. Make some barbecues and we cook together and we share our meals. Pubs, clubs. Watching movies, so animes. I play football. I'm playing as a goalkeeper. I like rurals in Buj. First thing I saw when I moved to this city. I'm living here in Buj for over five years. Two years. I've come to Poland back in 2018. The admission staff is great. If you have any kind of issues, we will be happy to answer. I live in a dormitory, very, very comfortable. I'm so far from AG. Our teacher, she gave us one case study. We interviewed people. And this project is about the exchange. I need. A Russian speaker, English speaker, Turkish speaker. We just banged the presentation. It was a great experience for me. One of the best in my whole life, I would say. Okay, thank you for watching. Now I can answer to your questions. Zatia is asking, can we work part-time during study in Poland? Uh, yes, uh, if you are a student, you can, uh, you can work part-time and also full-time, uh, having a student status. The students have a full access uh, to the uh, job market in Poland. Mm, Setanai is asking, do we need to speak Polish to study in Poland? Um, no, we have the programs in English language. So if you are, uh, if you are uh, English speaker, you can study uh, one of our English majors. Um, if you have a basic knowledge of English, you can also register for our 
uh, English language course so we can prepare you for further studies. Um, Irem is asking um, for masters in Poland. Um, yes, even if in our uh, and our, uh, Irem is asking about uh, about the uh, nursing. Even at our university, we have nursing department, but it's only in uh, Polish language. So to to study nursing in Poland, it's better to to know Polish and uh, because. Um, during the nursing studies, you have to uh, make the internships uh, at the Polish uh, Polish uh, hospitals, and you have to deal with patients patients in Polish hospitals. So it's rather recommend to to know Polish language. Bulut is asking about the uh, about the language requirements. Yes, as I thought before, we are offering the English preparation uh, preparation year. Um, so uh, subscribing for this uh, English course, which lasts one semester or uh, one year, you can we can teach you English so you can later study uh, in English language. Mm, our language requirement is uh, at least B2 level in, of English. Uh, so if you have already a certificate confirming uh, no uh, English at B2 level, uh, you can uh, you can be registered for studies. Ahmed is asking about scholarships. Uh, uh, usually, we each student basically can apply for the rector's scholarship after the one year of uh, of his education. Um, the rector's scholarship. Uh, is uh, is for high GPA or some outstanding achievements uh, during these studies, but also if some students will uh, find himself or herself in a bad economic situation, we can offer offer the uh, um, social scholarship. Uh, right now, we do not offer studies totally free, which are funded by European Union, but maybe next year we will find such program for free studies. So uh, it will be available to uh, in, in our website to, to see the program. Um, Perrin is asking about the tuition fees. Uh, all the tuition fees you can find on our website. Uh, our website uh, is aag.lodz.pl. When you are going for students and kind candidates, you can see the fees here. Um, fees for non-European citizens uh, for master degree is 3,100 euro for both political science or management program. Mm. Computer science studies are a little bit uh, more expensive and it costs 3,300 euro for one year. Uh, 
Um, Julia is asking about the duration of bachelor's. Uh, bachelor's studies are last lasts uh, three years and those are six semesters. And master studies lasts two years. Um, living expenses. Um, for your living expenses, uh, you should have about 500 euro for uh, for one month. It should cover your um, the uh, the fee for renting an apartment or or sharing a room, and uh, the other fees uh, like um, like um, 200 euro for for the food and uh, and your daily. Uh, daily expenses. Um, we do not have our own dormitory, but we are cooperating with uh, three dormitories in Łódź. Uh, our students there have uh, some discounts. The offer of those dormitories you can also uh, find on our website. Um, when you will go to for students candidates and clicking lodgings, you can find here the offer of the um, dormitories. Um, here are the links and also the email addresses uh, of the of the uh, receptions desks to these um, dormitories. Um, if you have more questions, um, if you have more questions, please, I'm here to answer it now. I'm sending you a link to our website with um, with the offers of the dormitories which we are. Uh, with which we are uh, collaborating. If you have any more specific questions, you can write an email uh, directly to me, which is kcecha at aag.lodz.pl. On our website, you can also see the uh, how to uh, how to uh, gain admission to our to, to our university. Here also, you can find the contact to our office, uh, our recruitment office, and the scan of admission pro process. First of all, you have to choose your program, uh, fill out the uh, online application form, uh, then you are getting a login and password to upload your documents. Mm, you can also send your documents by email in scans. Uh, then you can pay the fees upon the offer letter, which we will send you by email. Um, if it is necessary, we can uh, make an on online interview with you. Uh, also, if the students do not have a certificate of the English language, we can just confirm the English knowledge during this interview. Um, 
after passing the interview fee, interview uh, uh, paying the fees and sending the documents which uh, entitles uh, the students to undertake the university level education the student receives an acceptance letter with this letter you can apply for visa and uh, hopefully get a visa and just make a travel to uh, Poland and to which city. Um, to, to make an application for studies, it's enough if you just uh, if you just click the admission button and here it directs you to the online application uh, online application form. We are choosing, for example, studies in English. Choose the program like graphics. Here you can see all the uh, the list of all the required documents. You just confirming your um, your choice. Then you can uh, register to studies, filling in the personal data. Then it will uh, pass you to the uh, next fields with more specific information about you. When you just fill in this application form, then we will uh, contact with you and send you the offer letter for studies. Thank you, Mr. Nechati Sozuos, who is the uh, who is our contact person and our uh, and our representative in Turkey and also in the United States and who is also with us here now. Um, Julia is asking also for the tuition fees. Um, right now the uh, the tuition fee is a little bit different for the uh, Turkish citizens and EU citizens. For e if you if you are holding the EU passport, then the tuition fee is lower. Do you have any more questions? On our YouTube channel, you can also find uh, more videos of uh, with our students both in Polish and in English language. Yes, Kasper, could you also please your YouTube channel in the chat box? Sure. Here you can find all our videos. Okay, if you do not have any more questions, uh, I am encouraging you to write us an, an email and you can, through, uh, you can write to us also uh, through Facebook. Um, I'm sharing with you our Facebook website. So you, if you have any more questions, uh, we will be happy to answer. Yes, thank you very much for your great presentation, Casper. Uh, and also, you covered all of the questions. 
Uh, we believe it was a really informative webinar for the attendees. Also, I would like to thank the participants in Turkish as well. Katıldığınız için teşekkür ederiz arkadaşlar. University of Humanities and Economics in Lodz ile ilgili diğer sorularınız için Kesper'in paylaşmış olduğu mail adresinden iletişime geçebilirsiniz. Aynı zamanda linkleri de incelemeniz fayda olacaktır. Altıdaki webinarımızda görüşmek üzere. Thank you again Kesper. It was a pleasure to have you in your free talk. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to, to be here and sharing with you. Uh, our university informations. Thank you again. Take care. Bye-bye. Goodbye.